Boom! Have you ever taken one of those hits in your business and it's almost like you feel like you've been knocked out, you don't know where you are, and you might feel a little bit lost? I know I've been there. Have you been there? Well, this is what you've got to start to do. It's called getting your shit together. Has there been a time in your life where you feel like, I've got to get my shit together right now? It's like it's not happening. It could be your health, it could be your relationships, or it could be in your business today. First thing I'm gonna get you to do to try to get your shit together is start with a goal. You see, when you've got something, you've got a goal, it's something to get you up. Now, some people struggle to just get up at the morning when they haven't got their shit together because they might be feeling sort of depressed. First thing I would want you to do is write down what I call an identity document. It means that write down is the person that you wanna become. So you might say, well, when I was like on fire, I was getting up at a certain time of the morning, I was exercising, I was contacting that many people, I was booking that many market appraisals, I was getting that many listings. That's what it looked like. So this identity document that you wanna write down should be around the type of person you wanna look like in your business, on your personal life, in your, in your health, and also your relationships, and etc. Create the person you wanna become. Then you wanna write a plan for the next 90 days. You see, when you wanna get your shit together, there's no point like saying, here are my goals for the next year. I had a client that sit down with me the other day and wants to do a five year plan, a 10 year plan. I said, I don't know about you, but this world is like, woo, going really, fast. did you like that, Tom? It was going, woo, really fast. The world is evolving so fast today that you know what? Don't think about five, 10 years. Think about the next year, the next two years, and the next three years, and then just pause and work on that, totally focused. But what I was saying is, just really think about some 90 day goals that you want to achieve and then break them down, chunk it down as to what that would look like. And when you align the identity document, which could be, I really want to get up in the morning and get my fitness back, start with that. Then the 90 day goal could be, I want to start getting some market appraisals. I haven't been on a market appraisal in three weeks, Claudio. I want to book two market appraisals a week. And then just get these goals for the next 90 days so you can just sort of get some short term focus. Don't think about the long stuff, think about the short term focus. The other bit that you're gonna find challenging is the mindset. Now we've all heard it, right? 80% of your success is up here, 20% we've heard from Tony Robbins is the mechanics. When you're gonna get up or you're gonna make that call, guess what's gonna happen? When you've taken a hit and you haven't got your shit together, you've got this little voice coming in and you self-sabotage yourself. It's like, do you really wanna make the calls? Let's have a look what's on the computer and check out some new listings when you know you need to make the calls. Or the alarm goes off in the morning, you wanna get up at five o'clock to do a gym workout and you hit the snooze button. And before you hit the snooze button, you're talking to yourself and you're going, Tom, it's warm in the bed, it's cold outside, it's dark, I don't really wanna hit the gym. I'll, I'll, I'll start tomorrow to go to the gym. And then tomorrow comes in, you hit the snooze button again and you go, oh, I'll start tomorrow. Has that ever worked out for you? Nah, it hasn't. So you literally have got three to seven seconds to make that decision right there and then before you talk yourself out of it to sort of say, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, get up in the morning, hit the button, turn the alarm off and put your gym clothes on and walk, use that physiology. Same thing with the phone. That's how you start getting your shit together because your mind is gonna be the one that's gonna self-sabotage you with all this negative thought and negative process. The moment you start to have something that will pattern interrupt with a seven seconds and counting yourself down, it's like an ignition starter. And guess what will happen? Things will start to get moved forward for you. Really simple, easy to do and easy not to do, correct? So if you need to get your shit together, here is what you need to do. Number one, start with a goal. Number two, make the goal and the plan short term focus. 90 days is all you need. Thirdly, work on the mindset. You're gonna be the one that's gonna be self-sabotaging yourself all the time. You've got seven seconds to beat the mind, push the mind back, and then take control, and guess what? Then you'll have your shit together.